got another nice coyote here. Uh, caught in a uh, wheat stubble chain, uh, crop change. I have corn down here. I have a nice western cedar edge right here. Kind of keeping the coyotes right here along the edge of this big open vast area. The, there is not a trail here. There was not a cattle trail, deer trail, or anything like that. However, I did see coyote tracks walking in between the wheat stubble. Also saw it, found a little scat. You know, we're not limited to just deer trails, wildlife trails, and cattle trails to put in our uh, to put in our trail sets. You can make the same thing over and over again. Just simply scrape it out, blend it out, put your trap in, and I think you can have yourself just as much success as I do here on this line. This coyote is very rambunctious. It's a beautiful coyote caught here in Western Kansas. Glad to have him. And uh, I'm going to put him down. We're going to get going. But believe me, these trail sets are dynamite. Anywhere you want to put them. That's up to you. So here is the remake. And we can, per we can very easily see the catch circle in this deal. But I uh, reestablished the trail running through here. And... Uh, I'll put you on a, on a different level, is I went ahead and I took some of the local brush here, in this case tumbleweed and a little bit of sage and stuff, and I just uh, mixed that stuff in uh, to reestablish the trail, to give, them a, to give them a sense of this is the way you want to go. This is the natural area to go. Now they got odor here, they know there's been a coyote here, they know they can smell the urine and everything else that uh, happens when you make a catch. Um, just, guys always want to ask this question, so I'm going to say it. Um, you notice uh, from the trail, I don't really have anything to say uh, stop here with the one exception is I do have, uh, I do have some scat, which I put a little gland lure on. The wind is kind of coming at me from the other side, so I put a little scat there. I'm going 8 to 10 inches pan center from the scat to the center of the trap. Same way with the, uh, with the cross direction. So, uh, great set. Um, making a trail set right where uh, the animals want to go. He's going to walk right through it again. The next guy is going to walk through it. Um, they will do it. Just kind of take the time to uh, add a little bit of uh, herbage to the area you know the whole idea is to get them to go the way you want we don't have to be drastic about it we can break off some some uh, buck brush or whatever we need to and let them know that this is the trail this is how you're supposed to walk through here it's just good sense and good guiding